Graham, clean sheet, three goals. That must have been a pleasing watch from the touchline. Yeah, it was um, it was enjoyable to be fair this evening. Um, I didn't particularly enjoy Saturday, but I enjoyed this evening. And um, tonight was a little bit more like us, a little bit what we'd uh, we'd we'd been working on over a few weeks. Um, we're still not there yet. We're still a work in progress, like I said on Saturday. But it was pleasing that a lot of the phases, a lot of the passages, and a lot of the patterns we've been working on over the last uh, four, five, six weeks has come off tonight. So uh, yeah, it's it's relatively pleasing. But that was um, that was against a good team as well. They were they were flying. They had a great win on Saturday as well. So uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We we are pleased. Yeah. Uh, went on Tyler, two goals uh, this evening, and uh, real strikers' goals, weren't they? Yeah, they were. I thought the third goal was magnificent. To be fair, he was on uh, he two goals, and he was on a hat trick. And um, personally, if it was me as a striker, I probably would have shot. I wouldn't have passed it. But in fairness to him, I think that's the camaraderie and the team spirit that they're building up in that change room. So I was relatively pleased, and it was a great goal. Just, uh, just the way we uh, the way we we built it, walked it, and uh, split. Strikers with uh, with one running through the holes, so it was good. It was uh, it, it was a great ball by Tyler. It was a good finish by Jono, obviously, and that's what the big man's all about. To be fair, so they looked a good partnership. We spoke on Saturday about a positive getting twenty minutes out of Jono tonight. You've got sixty five, another step in the right direction for his rehab. Uh, 65 wasn't planned let me tell you but I don't think I was getting him off the park until he scored a goal to be fair but he's he's a great asset to have he gives us uh, he gives us that out ball he gives us that diagonal he's a physical presence the ball sticks he's uh, he's the all round uh, striker and I said that back in January when I was taking him to the club um, I love the bones of him I think he's brilliant he's a great lad he's got a heart to goal he works hard and by the way when, when, when people are not doing it uh, he, he gets on the case um, he's, he's, uh, he's a good lad he's a good leader he's a uh, um, pleasing that we got time under our belt, but again, like I said before the game, we didn't have uh, we'd only got Tom Nichols fit all pre season for one reason or another. We didn't have Tyler fully fit, uh, there was paperwork, there was there was all sorts of issues. He had the blisters at Plymouth and uh, he had a virus this week against Wickham. We didn't, uh, Victor's only come in on the back of uh, a Barnsley pre season, so we haven't had all three of them in the building together fit. We haven't had a pre-season under the belt, uh, our pre-season that we'd like. So they're ca playing catch-up a little bit. So it's only really Tommy Nichols that was uh, fully fit over the course of uh, the pre-season. And a word on the back line as well. Two clean sheets now in a row. And young Alfie coming in to stand alongside Tom Davis this evening. I thought Alfie Kilgore was outstanding again this evening. And I thought to, uh, Tom, Tom Davis was brilliant as well. I thought the back four really defended well. We... Uh, we limited a very, very good Cheltenham team, a very dangerous Cheltenham team. We limited them to, uh, to very little, to be honest. Our goalkeeper didn't have much to do. Um, hats off, hats off to the back four on the goalie tonight. And I also thought Abs of Gogo in front mopped things up and, and, and cleaned things up really, really well. It was very efficient. It was, a, it was an all round pleasing, good performance. And just finally, looking now to build on this momentum heading into Saturday and the trip to St Andrews. Yeah. <laughs> Listen, if uh, if it was that easy, we'd uh, we we we'd all be uh, we we would be happy. But yeah, look, it's a tough game Saturday. It's 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 a tough game Saturday. But I want us to take this form um, tonight's game, the momentum, the confidence. It was important that we got something under our belt going into the weekend. Um, but over the course of the last couple of weeks, I haven't been too displeased. Yes, I was I was good. I was really good. Let's be honest with the result of Blackpool because I didn't think we deserved it. I thought we've uh, we've created a lot. Uh, at Blackpool and we made two errors which cost us um, so we set to work on that but we've been working the system for a, for a while and we've, we've, we've been really pleased with the patterns and the phases um, it's just that clinical putting the ball in the net that's that's the hard part and that's the hardest part of football so let's hope it's uh, let's hope it's a, a it's a morale booster it's a confidence booster and let's hope we can get some uh, some momentum on the back of tonight